Uh, Dane, you want to step up? Let's pull your thing up here. Hi, um, Dane Connect uh, with Cloudflare. I run a product strategy. Uh, our mission at Cloudflare is to build a better internet. Uh, over the past 24 hours, you guys have probably been to, through our network hundreds of times. Um, today, we have over 2 million customers, uh, ranging from uh, large media sites to your mom's blog to, uh, as of this morning, Ashley Madison. Um, and if you look at the traffic that goes through our network, in aggregate, we're one of the, the largest uh, internet properties out there. Uh, so you combine all, the, all of our, the two million plus websites, and we're bigger than Facebook, Google, and Yahoo from the number of page views we see on a daily basis. Um, and this adds up to over 1.8 billion people per month passing through our network. So literally, we see the, pretty much the entire internet, uh, almost every device uh, out there on every country. Um, to make all this work, we run a giant AnyCast network with uh, 35 pops around the world, and this creates a giant edge uh, perimeter where uh, it sits in front of uh, people's origins um, and their websites. Uh, and if you think about this, this makes us the largest diversified attack surface in the world. So we not only are a single place where people go and uh, their websites touch every day, but we have WordPress, we have Joomla, we have every different type of application sitting behind us. And so we constantly are scanned by botnets and everything and uh, see this data uh, and are constantly evolving. What's that? Well, Co-founder. Co-founder, yeah. Uh, let's see. So today, there's kind of two large categories of attacks that we see. One is very large distributed uh, DDoSs, and the other is people trying to attack vulnerable applications. Uh, for, in the first category, uh, in, the, in the first category, we, we're constantly seeing these attacks grow year over year. Uh, the latest large attack was over 500 gigabits. Uh, traditionally, people have been putting uh, equipment at the top of their rack, like fire, uh, firewalls, load balancers, mobile application firewalls. The problem is your network pipes just are not going to be able to handle uh, these large attacks. And that's where the AnyCast network comes into play. Uh, the second problem is there's always new vulnerabilities, whether it's OS level ones like Shellshock, uh, Heartbleed for TLS, uh, SQL injections. Uh, the number of vulnerabilities that are coming out is constantly evolving, and it's actually doubled uh, for the number of public vulnerabilities in the past four years. And these are just the ones for the public open source applications. And beyond the identification of them is the time it takes for people to roll out patches and uh, be able to catch these kind of uh, issues. Uh, the average, uh, Semantic says the average time it takes 59 days to create and roll out these patches. Uh, the great part about being behind the Cloudflare network is that you get to gain the, the knowledge of the two million other plus websites behind us, and we can instantly roll out patches that cover you. So uh, last year, you guys may remember Shellshock. Uh, one of the interesting things is about uh, within hours of it being announced, we were seeing botnets all around the world scanning us. And they're scanning us for different URL patterns with the Shellshock uh, uh, escape in there. Uh, we were actually able to tell Barracuda before they even realized their application was vulnerable because hundreds of our customers put Barracuda uh, web interfaces behind our service, and we were able to see that pattern constantly emerging and be able to tell Barracuda that uh, while your customers that are behind Cloudflare are safe, there's a zero day in your application that uh, uh, you should patch for other customers. Um, the last problem is that uh, your applications are no longer just in your data centers. Uh, your, their, your WordPress blog is hosted at one hosting provider, you're in AWS, you have cloud applications, and you need a, a single edge network to be able to protect all those different websites and be able to uh, evolve them. And this problem's only gonna get worse. Uh, you know, originally it was just desktops ac accessing the internet, it's been smartphones and uh, tablets and uh, other devices, and the internet of things is only gonna constantly make this problem even uh, larger going forward. So. Um, Thanks.